Welcome back, guys. It's your boy DJ. Welcome to episode six. We are going to continue. Um, if you remember, we met our friend, um, the big brute, the one that hit us over the head with the sword last time. Um, we met him and everything, and then we met a very special somebody. Her name is Sophia. We are fixing to hit the sea, and we've got to go get her boat out of the nearby town. So we got to get the boat first, and then once we get the boat, everything we'll be able to go out on the sea. So, with that being said, Amicia and Hugo is out on their own. So, let's get this party started. Start episode six now. Yes, must be a heat storm. You see the light? It's the lighthouse from the fisherman's village. Sophia's boat is there. Are we really going to sail in this weather? Hey, who are you? Don't Get go. Here. Stay here. What are you doing? No. No. Stop. Ah. No. There's another one coming. So what? I'll take care of him. Say the word. Command and I'll execute. Lord. He's all yours, Arno. Yeah! Come here! Yeah! Sorry. Losing was not an option. It's what I do. I can see that. Ready to fight! I'll be quick! I was meant to win! Shut up! The sea scorpion could use the rain to escape. They know her. Of course. She's been a thorn in their side for years now. Because she stinks. Oh no, take care of him! Let's fight! You shouldn't be here! <laughs> Sorry. Losing was not an option. gathering resources every time we go so we're making sure we got the stuff and everything upgrade whenever we need to upgrade
Always ready for a battle. Yeah! It's you and me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Where you're hiding. He's coming this way. He's all yours, Arno. Yeah! Come here! Ah! I was meant to ah! win. Arno, go up to this 
Just checking my inventory real quick. With you. Come on, keep patrolling and watch your ass. We're getting close. Last cats. It's a funny day. Let's keep going. Beasts. Vicious little bastards.
Laguna's a nice sunny place. Oh, yes. I can't wait. We're almost there. I need a workbench is what I need. And I don't think there's a workbench anywhere to be seen. Here. working my way over to the boat. So. Oh goody. There's a workbench here. But there's also a cutscene. Looks safe. Yes, it'll do. Hugo. I can take him. Get some rest. It will be fine. We'll be just there. Set the rats on him if he's not nice. Yes. Don't be so happy when she says things like that. Okay. Gotta use this workbench. Takes a whole new meaning to stabbing somebody in the back, don't it? <laughs> and I already know you. You don't know me anything. You don't make the rules. Fine, we can be friends if that helps. Let's try. But you'll end up wanting to kill me too. There's a workbench right here, let me... Ready to go? Oh crap, I ain't got enough materials. Are you kidding? I said my inventory was full. Well... Guess I can't upgrade nothing. 
But Fort Bridge didn't do me that thing. Oh, okay there. So that's the Rust guest, right? The one and only. I hope they didn't ruin it. Oh no, where's Hugo? I'm here. It's amazing. What are you doing outside? Get in the cabin. You're soaked. Yes, to the cabin. So how do we get this thing into the water? Go and lift the anchor with Amicia while I check the route to Lacuna. It's the crank at the prow. Leave it to me. Yes. No, it's not light. Ugh. It's an anchor. It's made to anchor. Do something about them. I'll look. Hmm. I see what I gotta do. Move, Arnold. There's that one. Food's ready. Good shot. Safe to go. Sophia doesn't seem to like you much. It changes with the wind. But she owes me either way. What for? For not killing her when I was ordered to. I see. That chain is blocking the anchor. Come on! Oh no, a little help. All right. We're almost there. Your brother will soon see Lakuna. I hope he will. Thing. Yes. Let's pull this anchor up and set sail. He likes you, so you should know. Hugo's dying. What? His blood is poisoned. If there's a remedy, it's on that island. Then let's make sure he gets there. Oh, he will. Amicia, are we leaving? Hey, what did I say? Go back inside the cabin. Yes, Captain. Let's finish with this anchor. Should. Sophia, come! What now? Crap! Those assholes tied up my sail? Then let's untie it. We don't have time to go up there. I could try to cut it. Yes! Get on the starboard pontoon. You'll get a better angle. Just don't damage the sail. What's going on? Nothing. Get ready. We're leaving for Lacuna. Lacuna? We're really going to Lacuna? I didn't even see his box. I can't pick them up. You can do it, Amicia. Please don't hurt my bones. She'll do it. Look. She's good.
And we're see where these we're sea dogs. Let's go. Chapter 8, Sea of Promises. <sighs> the sea is so quiet. Nothing. So, it survived the fire. Yes, it would take more than that. It survived Spain, Burgundy, Guienne. Well, barely that time. That's where it broke? Yes. The only time it failed to protect. You? No. Someone I shared my coat of arms with. Oh. I, I see. It's a sad memory to keep then. Some memories don't want to be let go of. Child. I think I know what you mean. Hey, you two! The sail's pulling port side. I need a hand. Go pull the rope on the other side. I'll give you some slack on mine. Understood. Got it! I just love this. It's good on my side. Honor? Me too. Well done. It must be great to pilot this thing. It's worth all the other troubles. Come on, take it. Oh, uh, <laughs> go on. You won't crash into anything. <sighs> BC so, learning how to sell a boat. Look at there. Amazing. It's the sea you feel. It's freedom. Thank you for taking us. Thank God, no. I'm usually not so kind. Oh. He's a bastard, I know. He has reasons to be deep scars. Not that it excuses- Amicia! Amicia! Oh, duty calls. I'm sorry. You're welcome. Thank you. Amicia, come! Look! There's something there! Lacuna, everybody. Lacuna. That's it! Lacuna! It's exactly like in my dreams! Thank you! Whatever's there, we'll find it together. Island explorers. Yes. You know, it's not important if I die. What? What are you talking about? The Magister Vaudan told me I'm going to die. God, no, Hugo, I'm so sorry. It won't happen. Don't be sad. I'm happy to be here. This boat is the best, and I like Sophia and Anna, even if you don't like him. Sorry. Just wanted to say we'll be preparing to make land soon. I'll need your help. Just come see me when you're ready. Yes, sure. I'm happy to be here with you.
ears itching a little bit. Alright, back to it. I think we're about to make landfall, guys. We are indeed. All I could say, looks can be deceiving. Remember that, people. Looks can be deceiving. here and I'll join you later fine we'll take a tour while it's still light and find a place to sleep sounds good by the way this land is under the Count's law be nice see I see to Lacuna. This is for you, my child. We're so honored by your presence. Thank you. Looks like we have a new king. Good King Hugo. That's right. During the brighter days, all children are kings. Just like the child of embers who watches over our island. Your presence is a blessing because you are the future, just like him. For he'll deliver all of us from the darkness. Please, enjoy the festivities. Thank you. Goodbye. Well, that's a pretty good start, no? I wonder what the church would think of this. They seem successful. Pray that we're successful. Well, come on, your majesty. Dream Amicia. It's the most beautiful place I've seen. It's very beautiful, yes. But now we need to find whatever called you here. Welcome! The market is just up the street. Plenty for you to see. Let's go, quick! Yes. Hey, wait, wait. So I heard of this dream and, well, I'd like to help. But first I must know what you're searching for. All right. So it's... Uh... It's a bit strange, but, well, go on, Hugo. Yes, in my dream, I woke up on the beach, and I was sick and scared, but a big bird came, and I followed him. I thought I was dying, but the bird showed me water that healed me, and there was a huge tree, too, and that's where I wake up each time. Good, so, bird, tree, and water. <laughs> could be anywhere but I guess it's a start we can ask at the market come on oh it's amazing so many colors and perfumes Amicia can we ask people about my dream uh, you shouldn't tell them that it's a dream and don't ask too many people you never know yes I'll ask Hello, sir. Would you... Is there a magic pond here? With birds and trees? <sighs> <laughs> I'm not from here, you know. I just come for the market. Maybe you have a bird? No. <laughs> well, thank you, sir. <laughs> Anytime. You're about as subtle as you are tall. What? Let's see the rest. Hello. Hello there. Would you know of a beach where we could find special birds? <laughs> this is an island, so the birds are mostly seagulls. Not a bird much dreamed of, I'd wager. <laughs> They're bloody thieves, I tell you. It's not a seagull. Let's go. Hey, thank you, sir. May your day be bright. <laughs> Yours too. He knows nothing. <laughs> well, he knows about seagulls. Be patient, Hugo. 
Come see my flowers. Perfect for the festivities. Roasted pork's ready. Who wants some? Oh, there's another one that we have to talk to. Bright fabric. Perfect to wear for the brighter days. All right. Let's try and ask someone here. Good work with the decorations, everyone. Oh, and if you still want to help, we need a hand with tonight's feast. Good afternoon. Hello. We've just arrived, and we heard about a beach with a pond not too far hmm that's very specific anyone sorry i really don't know me neither there's also a big tree <laughs> well we have lots of big trees you'll find some up on the plateau thank you anyway of course why don't they know dreams are tales of the soul pipsqueak not of this world. We'll ask again. The dancers Hello. and musicians are now in place. The festivities are about to begin. Come. <laughs> Can't wait to see that. Let's go. Oh, Amicia, can we go too? Sure, sounds nice. Should we be worried about the Count's army here? They look pretty quiet. Mm, different captain, different men, different land. Don't think so. Good. I hope there will be a dragon man. And I'd like to see a dragon man too. All this wasn't in my dream, but I love this place. It's all so dreamlike, yes. Islands can be nice little havens, but they're fragile ones. Oh, don't get gloomy. Chance! They're here. They must be about to start. Please, stick to the rhythm, all right, Lucy? No improvisation. I sing for the child of embers, and he needs energy. But not that much. All right, focus, please. We're going soon. Hurry up! Last year was so great. You, you think they'll do better? I know they've been rehearsing for months. I hope they'll cross the main square once again. It's the best moment. Who's this child of embers, anyway? A local deity, obviously. It's St. John's Week on the continent. The summer solstice. So it's probably all about fertility and prosperity. Is he magical? He's a god. Pagan one. Peaceful one. Yes. Mm. Oh! Dances! Missy dances! <laughs> I see that. You know how to dance this, Arno? Do I look like it? Oh, you never know. I'd like to see you dance. <laughs> You're 30 years too late, lad. I'll imagine it then. The walk of devotion has begun. The procession is coming. Let me see you quick. Blessed be the child of Embers. Blessed be the mother. Just in time. Wow! Say, would you like to bless them with flowers? I just throw some at them. That's it? Like this? Blessed be the child! Wait, I'll bless the dancers too! You go. Blessed be everyone! <laughs> oh, Lord. It's done. Thank you. Sorry about that. Oh, don't be. He was true to his heart. Now they're blessed for many, many years. You're a savage, Shorty. Let's follow the parade! Sure. Let's go wreak havoc somewhere else. I like blessing people. I really wonder there. why. Quick, quick! Calm down, we'll catch up with them. Blessed is, Blessed the, mother. is the mother! The mother is about Blessed to Blessed is the mother! <gasps> A crowd! What's going on? Where is she? She should have been here already. Um, sorry, sire. All right. 
Yes. You all know me. I'm not a man of words. Emily, your priestess, she will be here soon. She will open these brighter days with her beautiful words. The words of a mother. The mother of the child of embers. The child who protects what? his sacred land. It's him. From Come. the rats of disease and war. The rats? No, wait. Hey, what are you doing? Oh. It's because it's the Count Amicia. We had a deal. Call your rats. Wait, what? That was your deal? You saved me so he would murder the Count for you? You survived. That comes with a price. No. You don't take advantage of a child and call it a deal, Anna. We came all this way for him. You won't ruin that. Fuck it. I don't need you. No. Anna! I knew it. I won't miss this time. I'll take care of him. Catch the girl. No. No. This is not our fight. Run. Kenna. The girl of the Run, you go. But Arno. To hell with him. Oh, damn it. Stop. Quick. No, no. Hey, you. Through here. Trust people, Hugo. Nothing ever stays nice. It always turns bad. Always. Why? We're going back. It's too late. No. Things aren't always nice, but you can change them. How? The way we always do. We fight. We stop Arno before he does more damage. We save your dream. We need a way back, a discreet one if possible. What if Arno is dead? Or he killed the Count? We'll improvise, remember. Are we good at this? We bloody are. We're in a stable, there has to be something. Up and over. Locked. <sighs> be very careful. Don't worry, I know. Hugo? <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Sorry. I'm going to open the door. I'm going to stand behind it. Here. Let's get that cart in place. By the way, why did Arno attack the Count? He said that it's because of the Count that his shield is broken. Let's see if I can upgrade oh, here real quick. Let's get to work. <coughs> I can. So let's see here. Do I want additional stuff? No, I don't want a crossbow. Not yet. We're gonna do additional stuff. This should make things a bit easier.
Someone. Together. Go get the rest of the stuff out of the, uh, this other box over here. Just doesn't carry more stuff. The next thing that we upgrade, we're going to have to upgrade to crafting stuff. Got through that, didn't we? Oh, that was close, but we did it. That bird was awful. Now, where's that damn honor? 
Listen. Sword noises. Yes, yes, quick. They're here. The Count's alive. Can you stop him? Shut up! I'll kill you like I killed your men! You'll die anyway. And for what? The past is the past. I don't care. What do we do? Watch your language. So this is his army. A girl and a boy. No, wait, Victor, stop. Emily. Don't get carried away. She helped. They're not a threat. Of course, my love. I'll kill your bitch, Count! I'll teach you what it is to lose what you can Watch your about. language, Arno. You've always been a disgrace to the knighthood, Arno. And you've been a pain in my ass for too Are you long. all right? Lock him up. I'll handle that later. So where do you know this beast from? We shared a boat and had time to chat on the way, but I didn't know he was after you, sire. Now, if you're not bandits, who are you? Amicia. And this is Hugo, my brother. He's a bit afraid. Well, don't be. There was more fright than danger. These days are dedicated to life and peace. Would you agree to be our guests for dinner? Are you sure? I'm mean, sure. Emily's right. You helped, you deserve it. Come with us. Beautiful castle. Hugo, come. So, how do you like our terrace? This is really your house. <laughs> this is home. It's incredible. Come, come inside. Oh, it's big. It is, and it's only a small part of the palace. Oh, do you fancy some dates before we show you to your room? Dates? What is it? A fruit, Hugo. Can I? Come on. Sure, Your Grace. Please go easy, Hugo. Yes. I know this all looks pretty formal, but please. Here I'm not Your Grace. I am the mother. I am myself, so be yourself. Yes. During the brighter days, all the people of Lacuna are one. United around the so? child of Emily. I love it! Ha <laughs> ha! A bon vivant. Be careful. They're very rich. So where are you from? Guyenne. We fled the war and the plague. We came here hoping for a better life. And we heard of this island. You were right to come here. Let's keep going. You must be tired after this adventure. It's amazing. I know. Can't wait to see our room. Agnes, go get a room ready for two, please. Certainly, Mother. She's her mummy. No, it's symbolic. And these are our gardens. My favorite part. Splendid. Finally, they clean to the basins. Yes, aren't they nice? You're quite young for such a long trip. Where are your parents? Mummy is somewhere, but Dad was killed. By who? How? Uh, Hugo. Victor, don't be so... Military. <laughs> you know me. Come next to me, Hugo. Yes. You see those plants? Most of them are not from here. But we managed to make them grow anyway. And they look great. Thanks to a lot of love and care. We are just like them, you know. We drink water. <laughs> and we need a good soil, love and care. This land is open to you, if you wish to keep growing here. But of course, the big sister will decide. Right, Amicia? Thank you so much. Those were kind and true words. Let me show you something else. Victor? Of course, Come, love. Hugo. The land here is strong. The child of embers breathes life into it. We created the brighter days to celebrate him. In the hope he'll come back to us 
as it is foretold. To us, his mother and father. And to the people, we pray to him, not as a god, but as our long sleeping child. We love and revere him to revive his flame. Would you pray with me? You can do it in your own way. Sure. Hugo? I'll pray to the bird. A humble flame to light his night. And may he rise, a sun, a sun, so bright. So bright. So bright. Thank you. I appreciate it. Shall we go? Uh, sorry, mother. Could we take some time to pray for our father? Hugo? Yes, of course. I understand. I'll wait for you. Come when it is done. Dear father. Hugo, is it really your bird? Take a good look at it. Oh, yes. I feel it. It has the same beak. And I just know it. Good. Very good. Let's go back to them. And no word about that to anybody here, right? It's our secret. I know. Is everything ready for tomorrow? Yes. The new robes look wonderful. It will be perfect. Excuse me. Oh. Shall we go? Sure. I must say, we appreciate that you paid homage to the child so willingly. Every child bears the future of the world. One child can change everything. That is very true. Here it is. Rohan? This is too much. Nonsense. You're our guests. There's a good dinner being cooked. Shh. Oh, we'll need to get you some new clothes. It looks like you had a long journey. Are you going to kill Arno? Sugar. He will be judged. All those who do bad things are, and he did a lot. But you will have the chance to testify if you wish to do so. But enough of that. We'll leave you to rest. Tomorrow, feel free to enjoy Lacuna. Brighter days are the best time for it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> My lady. Beds are great. Try jumping on them. Yes! All right, guys. That can tell that, that pretty much does it. That's uh, we're on number nine now. Tales and Revelations. No, actually, yeah, we're on number nine. So, but with that being said, we are going to call it right there, and we're going to pick up the next episode soon. So, stay tuned. I'm your boy DJ. Remember to sub, like, and share if you like the story so far. Remember what I said at the beginning of this one. Looks can be deceiving. Keep that in mind, people. I'm your boy DJ. Y'all stay sexy. I'm out.